with every American was to fall out. This note was a promise that all men, yes, black men as well as white men, would be guaranteed the unalienable rights of life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness. It is obvious today that America has defaulted on this promissory note insofar as her citizens of color are concerned. Bridgewater State also celebrated Martin Luther King Day by making it a day of service to the community. Jesus came. Jesus came. Your mom was well. Your mom is enough to just say we should and we should say we must be the change. And that's why I am here. I am here because you cannot become a man with a mind of Malcolm, voice of Martin, fist like Ali, but a heart like Gandhi. I had a few conversations with Sasha and said, you know what, I'm so concerned about this young lady that she will always be the last person I drop off so that I can spend an extra hour, extra two hours, whatever it took to make sure that I was going to see her the next day. And to see her now, it makes it all worth it. It truly does. years ago, I guess you'd say two years ago, when President Obama, um, this was actually his first service event. Uh, I believe it was a day before his inauguration, if I'm not mistaken. It was also a huge snowstorm here. And we were shocked that over 160 students, faculty and staff came out to volunteer. And we were amazed and wondered if it was the Obama effect in terms of seeing, you know, him and the First Lady doing this, you know, why not we do it too. Um, and we love the motto that it's a day on and not a day off. And it is a day for people to come together under service and do something good for someone else. And uh, I think it's really been a successful event. Um, Congress made this the only uh, national, or rather federal holiday that's about service. So, you know, what better way to spend a, spend a day off by serving others? Oh, happy day when Jesus was. Lunch bags we um, are going to donate to uh, Father Bills and Mainspring in Brockton. Um, these will be given as extra lunches that can be given to the uh, guests at Father Bills and Mainspring or the people that do come in um, who are in need of a, of a meal. Uh, we have uh, ham sandwiches, uh, cookies, uh, juice, and some other little snacks. So that kind of gives them a little bit of something. It's not a lot, but at least it's something that would kind of help them get through the day. And the other thing that our volunteers have done is to put a little note of encouragement in the, um, in the lunch box as well. We always are involved in the MLK Day breakfast. We love that particular breakfast. And then we always normally do a day of service anyway. So when we heard that the day of service is actually going to be on campus, we said let's join this community that we love so dearly and we've been participating for years. And I've been personally participating with my family um, in this breakfast for at least 15 to 20 years. So. Every hill and mountain shall be made low, the rough places will be made plain, and the crooked places will be made straight, and the glory of the Lord shall be revealed, and all flesh shall see it together. This is our hope. This is a faith that I go back to the South with. With this faith, we will be able to hew out of the mountain of despair a stone of hope.